Hi everyone, my name is Rachel Stewart and I'm here today to present to you on social loafing. The definition of social loafing is the tendency for individuals to put forth less effort when they are a part of a group. All members of the group are pulling their effort to achieve a common goal. Each member of the group contributes less than they would if they were solely responsible for the project. For example, your professor assigns you to work on a class project with a group of three other students. While in the group, you and two of the members take full responsibility and do all of the work, while one group member slacks off on the duties because they figure the other members will pick up the slack. So how can social loafing be prevented? Prevention tools include assigning a group leader or task manager, peer evaluations, keeping communication open and transparent, daily or weekly check-ins, develop rules of engagement, assign tasks to each member on an efficient basis, and if possible, keep groups small, around two to four people. Ultimately, there are many benefits to group work. Students develop communication and teamwork skills, division of content divided equally. Students can also work together to pool expertise and skills, and ultimately students learn how to collaborate as a group. Thank you for listening to my presentation and here are my references.